than half a minute to play. And the Huskers will force Baylor to watch that clock continue to melt away. Pursuing that ball in space. Pointer looking for another fortunate bounce. That ball won't settle initially. Runs out of real estate. Final seconds counting down. The Huskers concede their first goal on the year. But in the end, they're right back into the win column. They saw a lead evaporate only to reclaim an advantage right before halftime. They're going to leave Waco with a 2-1 decision, spoiling the home opener for Baylor. Yeah, I think an important indicator of kind of team spirit and mentality is sometimes it's not going to be the prettiest, but can we be gritty and find a way to win? And that's what Nebraska did today. And for Baylor, I think they can be very encouraged by their energy and intensity, especially in that second half. They just kept Nebraska under pressure, but they've got to figure out a way to break that final line. Can they get around those corners? Can they break through, combine with each other to get some more shots off in behind the defense? For Nebraska, that first goal again from Sarah Weber, her first of her collegiate career. Olivia Brown with the game winner, sandwiched in between the first peak goal on the year for Gabby Mueller and Baylor. So for Jessica Stamp, I'm Lincoln Rose saying so long from Waco, Texas with a final score. Huskers hang on for a 2-1 victory. All games airing on the ESPN Networks are streaming live and archived on the ESPN app. This has been a presentation of ESPN.